Everybody, welcome back to Tony'sPicks.com. I'm Tony T. It's time for NHL's segment here. All four games on the card, brought to you by our professional handicapper Steve Doug, who's a top unit performer over at Tony's Picks over the past seven days. Nearly 1,200 units of profit. Let's bring him in right now. Steve, how's it going tonight? Excellent, buddy. Yeah, we're hitting good. Every uh, I want to thank all the people over and purchasing patch packages and stuff. Really helps out a lot. Makes me feel good and makes me work harder on these picks. So, thanks for coming in. Absolutely. All right, we got a four-game card here for Friday in the NHL. We'll get it started here with Hurricanes Capitals. Hurricanes two hundred five in the row. Total six. Hurricanes are playing five games in seven nights, Joe. That does not happen very often. I think it happened once last year. Um, I think St. Louis did it. And then the COVID year, it happened a couple times because, of course, they had to do makeup games and stuff like that. But if any team could pull it out, the Hurricanes are probably the one, you know, we're talking about Rod, Bob. These guys are well-conditioned athletes, but... Man, that's a lot to do. I, I gonna, if you're gonna give me plus 170 against any team, he games playing five games in seven nights, or plus 164 as we have here right now, uh, I'll give them a shot. Big, they're a big, solid team too. The Capitals are gonna come out and lean on, on the Canes, and they're gonna play them hard with their physicality. They've got a lot of big Malenstein and Pro. Actually, I think Prodest is hurt, but a lot of big, solid Ovechkin. You know, Pacioretty, they got guys that can beat you up there. And if your legs aren't 100%, the Capitals can burn you. So I'm going to give them a shot, a plus 164. Not to mention, they need it. They need this big time right now. So they're going to be totally focused on beating the Canes. All right, Steve. Doug can get his best bets over at TonySpace.com. <clears throat> Hurricanes and Capitals. He's on the Capitals here. Plus 164. Hey guys, look, click the link in the description and you'll get to Steve's handicapper page. The promo code Tony T at checkout will save you 20% off all this premium pick packages. Let's continue here on our NHL rundown here for action on uh, Friday's car. Next up will be Penguins and Stars. We see the Stars minus 198, total six and a half. Penguins don't have any defense, and I think they finally figured out that they just got to stop trying to pretend that they do. They just don't. Um, getting Carlson certainly didn't help that all that much. Stars have been shooting uh, shooting the wind right now. They've been scoring a knot, so they should be able to score on the Penguins. And the Penguins, since they realized that, you know, we can't play a 1-3-1. We're just not going to win games. Nobody really wants to. Anyways, might as well gunner and see what we can do. It seems like they're doing so between those two things, I think you got an over six and a half here. I think the series history is over too, if I remember correctly. So we got that as well. Uh, all right, Steve Duncan, you'll find us in place over at TonySpace.com. Penguins and Stars likes this one to go over total of six and a half goals. All right, let's continue here on our NHL rundown. This will be for the games here on Friday. The four game card next up will be Blue Jackets and Avalanche. We see Avalanche 345, total six and a half. Tough spot for the Blue Jackets. Um, anytime you play the Avalanche, it's a tough spot, actually. It uh, could be a little bit of a letdown spot for the Avalanche, but they've been playing with business-like attitude, man. They've been playing with hate in their heart this last little while. It's been fun to watch. I didn't have the Avalanche start the season to win the Cup, but I'm soon quite a bit more to that now ever since especially Nitschen came back. I don't know what he did with his uh, mental health or whatever. He, he got something and that's wonderful for him. But when, now that he's come back, it looks like a warrior man. He looks unbelievably focused on what he wants to do. And of course, we already know McKinnon can do that. The Blue Jackets, yeah, they'll give it a go, but if the Avalanche have any of that mean streak in or that hate in their heart for the Blue Jackets at all, they should ruin them here. I'll take a minus one and a half. All right, Steve Duncan. It says here in this one, Blue Jackets and Avalanche. Avalanche puck line, lay the puck in half here at minus the 142. All right, let's continue here on our NHL rundown. Uh, play every play on the board for tonight, guys. Remember, get Steve's best bets right now over at his site. Over his handicapper page at Tony's.com. Click the link in the description to get there. All right, next up will be 
Kraken and Coyotes, 110 on both sides, total five and a half. Kraken on a back to back. Uh, playing Vegas right now, I think they're still in it. Uh, I'd have to check it out, but they can't score with a damn. I thought they might be able to open it up tonight a little bit. They wouldn't be choking on their sticks so much because they pretty much knew they were out of it. But it ain't happening for them. Um, I I don't know who the goaltenders are going to be, so it makes it a little difficult to uh, cap this. I'll, if, if the goaltender's in, I'll probably have a pick on it. Go, uh, go, go over and check me out there, uh, see what that pick will be. But... It should be Ingram, and for the Kraken, it should be Decord. And since the Kraken are just having such a difficult time scoring, and the Coyotes actually have been shutting the odd team down a little bit. Uh, th two games ago, they only allowed one. The game before that, they only allowed one. I think that was right. So they, they've been shutting teams down, and since the Kraken can't shoot at all, I think the Coyotes will probably win this game. I I, I I'm going to take them on the money line as of right now. Now, with goaltenders, it might change. Actually, I might even have a play on the total depending on the goaltending here. So come over and check me out and you can get that pick. Uh, it looks like we're hitting both of our best bets today in hockey. Could have had those. Could have had those for a cheap price and uh, made yourself a little scratch. But uh, make sure you're over there tomorrow. All right, uh, Steve, I can get his place here at TonySpace.com, Kraken Coyotes. It'll be Coyotes here at minus the 110. All right, Steve, let's take a look over at TonySpace.com here for Friday's action. Of course, uh, Steve, top leader producer last seven days. Nobody hotter last seven days than Steve Duncan. Nearly 1,200 years of profit, all sports combined, led by NBA and NHL. Been an absolute fire right now. Uh, we got, uh, of course, plays here up, up on the board here, NBA. We got uh, NHL. March Madness as well. What we have going on over at TonySpitch.com for Friday? Oh, we'll have we'll we'll have some uh hot we'll have some hockey plays for sure. Pretty sure I'm gonna have a best bet. We start down MLB a little bit now. I uh, like I don't put too many picks out early in the season. Like to see how it checks out. Of course, we got Matt, March Madness. You know we're gonna have something there, and uh, I think NBA. I might be two and zero today. Again, NBA has been hot, hot, hot. So I'll probably have a best bet over there for that. And always, as always, take the bow. Come in for a week. Come in for a month. Uh, it's much better than just throwing a, a pick here, a, a pick for $19 or whatever. Like you do that every day, it's going to cost you a lot of money. Um, better value to get your three-day package or, or one week or especially the one month. And uh, as you can tell, I was on, I've been uh, top capper the last seven days. And I'll tell you what, that is a honor because we have amazing cappers on this site. Very, very good. Very, some of the best you're going to, so to, to ever, if you can even spend a week on top of the board with these guys, yeah, it makes you feel pretty good. So, uh, yeah, come check me out, man. That's right, guys. Get up over with Steve Duncan over at TonySpix.com. You can see, again, the record. You're 1,191 units of profit last seven days. Top of, cop capper last seven days. You're top of the leaderboard. So get on board. Of course, uh, click that link in the description, and that will land you right on Steve's handicapper page. This is where you can get his, his plays. You can, about, by the way, these plays are all documented, so you can verify all the results over on his handicapper page. So every play is uh, recorded here, as you can see. As you scroll down this uh, this bar, you will see all all the uh, the uh, plays that uh, Steve has put up, and you can see the the documentation here. You can verify that, and of course up here, all his all pick offerings. Uh, keep an eye on. They want to try them out for the week. We got the one month, the one year, the three day, whatever works for you. Go ahead and get signed up. It's the best value right there. Instead of buying the plays individually, that will cost it. It is costly doing that. Just buy the one month pass or the three day pass. You pick it. You'll save. It'll be better offer there. We'll also save you some more money when you use that promo code Tony T at checkout. You can access Steve's page by clicking the link you see in the description click the all cappers tab and he'll land right on his page go ahead and get signed up all right steve as always a great having the show here have a great now friday and we'll catch up with you again tomorrow yeah gonna be a great card for saturday tomorrow i'll see you guys all there have a good one everybody enjoy your weekend as well for steve i'm tony t we'll talk with you guys again tomorrow